Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. You are with, uh, again, once again, Tikozia, Dr. Mark. Tonight we have a beautiful guest, a beautiful young woman who's been working in this community for so long. And it's a pleasure for me to have her in, a, in, in my program tonight because it's, uh, a, a, I have been looking forward to interview her, to, to get her to talk about what she has been doing in this community. And also, furthermore, uh, particularly, we are almost at the end of the year and we know you have to begin to prepare all your facts and your data and your paperwork and of course she will tell you why and I'm not going to tell you what she does because she will also inform you. Good evening ma'am, how are you doing? I'm doing well. Uh, can you please inform uh, my audience about your name? And well, my name is Darlene Pierre Lewis. Miss Pierre Lewis. Yes. And I have been in the community for over 30 years, but I have been in business for myself for over 15 years. And I have been involved in the community doing translation and interpretation, but my passion and my desire is to help small businesses operate the way that IRS wants them to, mm -hmm. with the proper regulations, mm -hmm. with the proper bookkeeping mm -hmm. and organiza organizational structures. Mm -hmm. And so what I do is I set up corporations, mm -hmm. I interview partners before they set up a partnership mm -hmm. to explain to them the responsibilities mm -hmm. that are involved in a partnership. Mm -hmm. We also, once we set up the corporation, we do the books, we can get their local licenses, we can get their DBPR licenses, mm -hmm. everything that they need to be a legitimate com company, that's what we do, that's what our firm does. Mm -hmm. um, our firm is called Economic Solution Services, Inc. Mm -hmm. And we have several CPAs on board, we have several budget analysis on, on board, we have accountants, we have interpreters and translation, translators, and we are certified court interpreters mm -hmm. and certified medical interpreters. Wow, this is a very multifaceted business. Yeah. And, um, and I know you are good because I've heard about it and I've had friends who have used your services. However, whenever Haitian heard the, you know, like corporation and LLC, can you please explain to them what is a corporation? We both use the word partnership, but let's just, let's just go f the two first, okay. so we don't want to confuse our people. Well, so what is, what is a corporation? A corporation, a lot of people have a passion or a desire and they set up a business or they start a business. Mm -hmm. You don't always have to incorporate the business. Okay. And what I mean by incorporate is to make it a legal entity. Mm -hmm. And that corporation gives you a protection from lawsuits. It gives you protection from, from malpractices. You know, some people just come into your place and they are negligent. Mm -hmm. They don't follow your instructions or your rules and they think they're going to sue you. Right. But when you're incorporated, you have more protection. I so they see. can sue the corporation itself, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. not you as an individual okay. for what you have built on your own. Oh, that's the corporation. That's what corporations okay. provide for you. What do they mean by LLC? I never understood that. An LLC, there's so many acronyms. It's yes. a limited liability corporation. Limited liability, liability corporation. corporation. That means okay. you are protected from liability of a lawsuit, mm -hmm. but only a limited amount. Okay. So you could still personally be liable, be liable right. not, for the Not injuries. to the full amount. Not to the full amount. I Your see. corporation is limited, mm -hmm. and then you yourself personally are limited. I see. So the corporation is, you cannot be sued, but the corporation can be sued. Yes. With the limited liability, both of you can be sued, can be sued because yes. you only have a limited, limited. Okay. a portion, like a partial, a partial, okay. a partial protection. Very good. Okay, and also partnership. What do you mean by that? Like, let's just say you and I, we can have a partnership. What, I, do, what do you mean by that? A lot of people don't understand what partnership means. Mm -hmm. Let's say you have a passion and a desire to start a business. Yes, ma'am. But you have the location, you have the credit, but you don't have the funding. Mm -hmm. You can have me partner with you, but okay. there's several different ways to do the partnership. Okay. I can be a silent partner. That okay. means I never put... I never set foot in your property. People don't see I just me. support you financially You're behind invisible. the scenes. I'm invisible. But the money is there. The money's there, and you and I have a contract. Yes. How I'm going to get paid back. Of course. But I'm not involved in the day to day operation. Mm -hmm. But because you and I are partners on paper, if you were to fall short mm -hmm. or if your character was to be. Um, tainted, mm -hmm. then I can step in and take over because you violated our contract, our contract depending right. on what's in the contract. Of course, of course. But then a lot of people say, oh, I know him. He's a great person, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to set up a partnership with him. And they set up what is called a limited liability partnership. Mm -hmm. 
or they can just set up a corporation. Mm -hmm. And because the corporation, like with the LLC, mm -hmm. if you have one person mm -hmm. on your LLC, mm -hmm. it's considered a single member LLC. Mm -hmm. But if you have two or three or four, then it becomes a multi-member okay. LLC. And once you have a multi-member LLC, you become a partnership. Okay, but on that basis, mm -hmm. what do they mean by a DBA? I always a, hear that. I know. Yeah. Like, for example, my corporation is called Economic Solution Services, Inc. Yes, ma'am. But I did my DBA under Economic Solutions, Inc., Okay. Which is weird. It's the same name. So it's like a. a, a, a it's I'm, do, like, it's I'm like economic a solution and services and I'm doing business as. That's as. what DBA means. DBA. I'm doing business as. as I have a lot of people who come to me who mm -hmm. I don't feel mm -hmm. are personally responsible enough to set up a corporation because mm -hmm. corporations require bookkeeping and accounting. They require organization. Every business does. Mm -hmm. But the corporation IRS could call you anytime and want those. As. Whereas a sole proprietor, they know that you're not that organized. They may ask you for your tax returns and a few records, but it's not as great. Mm -hmm. So, so for the corporation, mm -hmm. you have to maintain record. Meaning what? You have to maintain meetings. You have to have, you meetings? Have, to have meetings. Even if it's to, you, you have a meeting with yourself. Let's say your office is located in Lake Worth, and you right. decide you're going to go to West Palm. Uh -huh. You have a meeting on this date. I've decided. The corporation has decided to move its lo office, um, local office or primary office mm -hmm. from Lake Worth to West Palm. Yes, ma'am. Can you? Um, I, I know it may be uh, because you are very fluent in English. I could <laughs> say see. it in Creole. So, but no, no. We, the reason why I'm saying that because a lot of us, yeah, particularly Haitian, yes, we are not aware of those things because oh, you know. Yes. Let me tell you something. I made big mistake. Yeah, I, be, I have my corporation for five years. I never keep. Any no, records? No, nothing. I mean, I mean, wow. I keep records. I do my tax. Well, you do your you know, taxes, and you have an appointment you know, book. I have an appointment you book. You keep an appointments. You have yeah, logs yeah. for your clients. Yes, I do. Okay. But it, I don't really meet with my partner. I mean, with my other person in the corporation. Yeah. To say, uh, to be uh, meet. You know is, is that a monthly you thing or is, is, it, it, is it weekly? It's up to you how you want to set it up. Mm -hmm. Do you want to do it quarterly okay. or whenever there's a big change? Okay. I don't have a meeting every month with myself. Ah, bon dieu, bon dieu, bon dieu, bon dieu. Okay, pour nous même qui parle créole là, nous sommes qui est très important qui n'a pas couvert à soi parce que bien des fois que nous fait corporation mm -hmm. nous fait ça nous les non charitable oh, organisation wow. yes, yes. nous et non et puis nous nous coupons pas qu'est bas ça nous les NGO en Haïti à boy site même 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 c'est charitable organisation yes. bon mais cependant nous gagnons pile nous même nous pas qu'on est parce que donc ça fait que à soi là son plaisir pour moi m'inviter Miss Pierre lui à cette Miss ils adorent que Miss Pierre lui yes. Ok, okay. Miss Pierre lui avec nous que nous connaît qui est dans le business depuis 15 ans. 30 ans de communauté, mais 15 ans dans le business. Et puis qui connaît bah, ça. Donc, euh, bref, moi, pas besoin de faire un paquet de détails. Non? On nous dit corporation. Non, quoi. Corporation, c'est une organisation. Corporation, c'est une organisation qui ou, ou, a une permission légalement dans l'État, spécialement oui. fédéralement. Fédéral, uh -huh. Et puis avec un euh, niveau state. Là. Oui. C'est ça, corporation. Okay. Il y a deux styles de corporation. Il mm -hmm. y a C Corporation okay. avec S Corporation. Okay. C Corporation, il y a beaucoup de monde qui pense que c'est le sunbiz.gov.org. Il mm -hmm. créé une corporation et il est fini. Mm -hmm. Depuis que vous faites un conseil, vous quittez le, c'est Silly. Ça veut dire que vous avez pour taxe pour le compte. Pour le business, là. Le, fini, le business a fini de payer des taxes sur le profit qu'il fait. Si le business a fait profit, vous avez même personnellement un lot de taxes pour le fil. Peut-être pas pour un com qu'on prend dans mes business là. Et puis, quand il y a qui disent pas prendre un com, mais nous disent est-ce que pas payer, de l'eau payer, lumière payer, qui j'en fais payer. On a l'argent business en prendre, ok. Qu'on a pas justifié, qui j'en fais business en rentrer 30 000, et vous même vous prenez 20 000 ou payer de l'eau, lumière, vous pas payer tout, mais vous payez tout. Donc, donc c'est C Corporation. Ça est C Corporation. S Corporation là, l'offre une fait dans Sunbiz. Ou besoin d'un form pour filer dans l'IRS, qui est 2553. L'offre une file forme ça. Forme ça, l'IRS a besoin d'une lettre d'approval pour dire oui, accepte comme un subchapter corporation. Subchapter corporation là, tax qu'on file là, c'est informational tax. C'est pas un tax qu'on paye tax sur lui. C'est un compte tax qu'on file pour pour voir le record de l'IRS. Donc, qui veut dire que nous avons une corporation pour capable file, ou capable ou même qui on est, pour capable file tout tax ça, on a pris un truc ou même qui non, 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 il y a tax ID number. Il y a un fil tax pour compte lui. Et puis, sacrété dans le tax là, ou un schedule K1, il y a sacrété ou pas payer tax sur lui. Il y a un fil tax pour et puis il y a un fil tax personnel pour lui. Il y a un fil tax sur lui. Ok, très bien. Ok, et LLC encore 
LSCA est le Limited Liability Corporation. Son corporation qui accepte, qui a prouvé simplement au niveau État, fédéral va reconnaître. Son loving fil LLC dans Sunbizard.org, à l'État, à l'État Floride reconnaître. Mais state la, I mean, fédéral pas reconnaître li. Mm -hmm. So l'offre fil en contact ça, si son seul ou même qui sous LLCA, ou ap fil information tax la avec 1040, regular tax return port. Mais sou gen plusieurs moun la dani, kon yon vin tombe dans la catégorie partnership la. Parce que um, IRS c'est 1040 il connaît pour individuel, li connaît 1065 pour partnership, 1120 pour C corporation, et puis 1120 S pour S corporation. Okay. So LLC pas gen numéro par li même. Bon, euh... Bien, ok, nous avons parlé de LLC mm -hmm. et puis que nous avons couvert ça très bien. Donc, si vous avez besoin de contacter, qui côté vous avez besoin de vous Vous avez appelé 561-251-1265. C'est en anglais. Mon numéro est 561-251-1265. Mon site est www.economicsolution.org. And also, too, I am at the station, WPBR, okay. on Fridays from mm -hmm. 7 to 8 p.m. Okay. in a show called Let's Get Real. Mm -hmm. It's being sponsored by AJE Foundation, I'm sure you know. Of course. And um, I'm located in Delray Beach, mm -hmm. and we've been there for the whole 15 years. We've been in Palm Beach County for 15 years. Great. Talking okay. about the AJE Foundation, AJE. Uh, tell us a little bit about because I heard they're going to have a great event oh coming my God. up soon. So it is us. so fabulous. Yes. AJE Foundation is really close to my heart because mm -hmm. they take care of my most precious, precious beings, the kids, mm -hmm. the less fortunate, the ones who are orphans, mm -hmm. who don't have parents, and especially after the earthquake in Haiti, mm -hmm. you know that there's a lot of kids who are devastated who are homeless. Mm -hmm. But AJE Foundation doesn't only work in Haiti, they also work here. Of course. And what I like most about them is that they help our teens, mm -hmm. because there's a lot of programs in Palm Beach County and all over the United States mm -hmm. to help the kids from birth, mm -hmm. even from, from infancy, mm -hmm. to 12 years old. But mm -hmm. once they hit 13, there's nothing for them. Mm -hmm. And AJE pick, picks up. Mm -hmm, he mm -hmm. helps um, his, I spoke with Antoine, he helps the kids with mm -hmm. the um, getting jobs, job training skills. But they have um, partnered with WPBR and um, I can't remember the name of the other orphanage. Mm -hmm. And there's going to be a lot of artists there. Olani, I've interviewed all of the artists. Oh, great, and great, it's great. going to be a fantastic event. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be a fundraiser, and you're holiday going to party. Too, right? I am going to be there. Oh, yes, of hey, course. <laughs> I'm going to make sure I'm, I'm on my own that night. Oh, okay. Ah, ah, ah. I don't want any trouble now, no, okay? Don't no worry trauma. About it. Don't worry about it. Yeah. But yes, this is a great event. We are still looking for found, for donations. Mm -hmm. We're looking for monetary donations. So mm -hmm, we need people to come out and bring mm -hmm. money. Mm -hmm. So where are we going to have this? It's great going event? to be at Pickley's Restaurant in okay. um, Delray Beach. Mm -hmm. The address is 3035 South Federal Highway, Delray mm -hmm. Beach, Florida. Mm -hmm. And it's just one, not even a block south of Linton Boulevard. Okay. okay so okay. it's on Federal. So I believe it's right across uh, Honda. It is across the Honda. I couldn't remember if it was Buick or Honda. Honda that was. That's why I don't give those yeah, landmarks. Know, you know, Haitian love Honda. Oh, okay. When they say Honda, they say, oh yeah, AJE. Okay. Bigley's restaurant. Well, they need to associate those yeah. two and come. And, and it's, a it's a beautiful restaurant. It is a very it's beautiful great. restaurant. Well managed. You know, and then I think you, you know, it's, it's good I've to... I've been there to, several yeah. times, and yeah. I've even brought some of my clients who yeah, are in yeah. Fort Lauderdale, so instead well, of bringing them all the way up mm -hmm. north, I have them meet me at the restaurant, we have lunch, and we discuss our businesses. Beautiful, beautiful, yeah, beautiful. so it's going to be a great event. We are accepting donation at the radio station mm -hmm, mm -hmm. in Lake Worth, mm -hmm. but we're also accepting donation... Um, especially monetary donation, mm -hmm. and I told everybody who's listening to me on the radio, mm -hmm. it is a tax deductible donation. donation you yeah. can write it off on your because tax they return. are a 501c3 exactly. organization. Exactly, not only just a 501c3, they are a 501c3 in good standing yeah. because there's a lot of people who know, are 501c3 who tell, don't have their good. Standing. Tell me about it, <laughs> because I know IRS will just suspend your 501c3. Yeah. If you don't pay the tax, at least don't report the tax. Not even pay. If you don't report the tax. Yeah, this is exactly what happened. Because a lot of 501c3s don't make, they don't have to pay any taxes. Of course, of course. You just have to report either the 990EZ form mm -hmm. or the long form. Mm -hmm. And I always encourage clients who have a 501c3, if they know that they are going to solicit big people to donate big money, do the long form. Pay the money, do the long form, because when people are looking to donate money, they want to see what have you have collected already. 
-hmm. who has donated to you already mm -hmm. how much what did you do with that money mm -hmm. the long form shows all that mm -hmm. and then they can say okay yeah I'm willing to invest in that company so yeah Saturday December 1st mm -hmm. at Pickley's restaurant in Delray AJE right. Foundation. So it was a pleasure to interview Same you. Here. However, I, I want you to briefly let's let's kind of come up to a yeah. conclusion. We are okay. So we talk briefly about uh, the corporation. So um, you know, so, ex, ex, tell these people because I know taxes coming yes. soon. So explain to them why it is important for them to keep good records. Yes. So this way they can facilitate because even the person doing the tax yes. can do even it even probably cheaper yes. if they have good if they records. Have good records exactly. Not just you know you come in here and there's this paper here, paper there. Yes. Well, what happens is I try to educate my clients who have been with me for 15 plus years. And so the record keeping is very important. And I don't say, don't go buy a big book or whatever. Take a notebook. Okay. Take a composition notebook where mm -hmm. the pages are not going to be loosely mm -hmm. um, removed. Mm -hmm. And you just keep track. track. Do it by what week, do it by day, do it by month. Keep all your receipts mm -hmm. and put them together in date order. Okay. And I even do a class okay. um, where I teach them how to put the... or. Um, put the papers together mm -hmm. and keep their records. And that's something Helen and I are going to be working together on. Mes amis, Miss Pierre-Louis, comme nous, c'est un monde qui est bien formé, c'est un monde qui connaît ça, Abdi, parce qu'il y a déjà expliqué nous sa corporation. Même moi-même, là, qui n'a pas eu à combien de temps, même pas eu à débat, je ne vais pas te réaliser. Donc, je euh, me dis, je suis bien content que je me suis dit avec nous à ce moment-là, dans ce cas avec Dr. Marc, nous sommes informés, communauté, informés tout le public là, tout que... Et J.E. Foundation, qu'elles sont membres là dans le coin et qu'elles ne prennent pas, et qu'elles ont un pile de bail qu'elles ont fait pour aider les teenagers, pour aider en différents programmes. Nous sommes en Haïti, mais bon, ici tout. Parce que bien des fois, on dit la charité, bien donné, commence par soi-même. We have to help people here, here also. So, uh, donc, please, nous avons encouragé nous pour nous relayer, Miss Pierre lui, et pour être capable de venir, pour montrer nous comment nous organiser, nous pour les taxes à venir, pour nous. Et puis, pour ne pas quitter le monde, à payer des cheats, nous tout. Yes. À payer des bornes. Yes. OK? So, bref, mon corps, dis-nous le numéro de téléphone pour nous finir. Le téléphone, c'est 561-251-1265. 561 Thank you, thank you. Et j'ai des petits causes avec Dr. Marc et merci à Pile Kiplet pour un euh, techni grand technicien. Oui, là, on est Kiplet avec Alain Daphnis. Merci Kiplet. Au revoir.